All new on Fox 5 News Edge at 11, state lawmakers are taking a look at the legal age to get married. Some say 16 is too young, and that should change. News Edge reporter Jacqueline Schultz joins us live from the state capitol, where it passed the House. Jacqueline? Yeah, House Bill 228 would raise the minimum age to marry from 16 to 17, would require more than just a parent signature, and also would put some strict guidelines on who exactly a teenager could marry. Children that were marrying adults that were twice their age. That was very scary to me. Representative Andrew Welsh of McDonough says it's time Georgia raised the age of marriage for the well being of children. The minimum age is 16 with a parent's signature. House Bill 228 ups the marriage age to 17 with a four year age gap. Max. We're talking about a 16 year old is probably a sophomore in high school. Welsh, a father of two daughters, says current laws should concern parents and calls child marriage stats in Georgia scary. 10,000 child marriages since 2000, hundreds with an age gap of 10 years or more dozens, even three times their age. Under House Bill 228, Welsh says if parents want a teen to marry, a judge must emancipate them if they believe it's safe. A child at the age of 16, 17 is still undergoing significant mental development. There's a, an opportunity for manipulation, um, coercion, even abuse. The Tahara Justice Center for Women Fleeing Domestic Violence tells Fox 5, Advocates have helped Georgia teens escape forced marriages and nationwide. The center claims younger brides may face abuse, human trafficking and lack of options for a way out with less education. I reached out Tuesday early evening to the 13 state house reps who voted no. None emailed me back. One said no comment, but lawmakers tell me their peers in the house voiced concerns if a teenage girl became pregnant or said their parents or grandparents did marry at 16. It may not be in the best interest of the child to get married to that individual. 